in this video i am going to solve an issue regarding ssl certificate so you can see uh, you can have a look at this site and see the url of this site and you can see this there is a lock icon over here and when i click on over here and it shows me connection is secured your information for example password or credit card numbers are uh, is private when it is sent to the site when it is sent to the site so it is uh, this site is completely secure whatever you submit etc so when i click over here over here right you can see there's https and a green padlock right uh, sometimes this https in is also in green uh, when everything is right right and now i'm going to show you another website that is my like uh, portfolio website and over here you can see that the icon over here is i like when i click over here and see your connection is uh, to this site is not fully secure attackers might uh, be able to see the images you are looking at on this site and uh, my, uh, and trick you by modifying them so when i click over here to edit the url over url you can see the http is, uh, https is already there but uh, it is not functioning in the right way so uh, even though even though this uh, issue might not be so severe but uh, for a like for a new user for a normal user uh, this uh, might be uh, like they might be scared to use your website or uh, to share their information on your website so you won't be trustworthy if you like have this kind of message on your site so so I, I will show you how to turn this into this like which would show like a protected green HTTPS with a padlock over here so so to do uh, to solve this issue so let me just uh, give a quick overview what I did to like to solve this uh, issue I already installed a plugin if I go to plugins to solve this issue I already installed a plugin a long time ago and that plugin is uh, really simple SSL so but it didn't help uh, solve this issue so recently I uh, solved this issue for a client and I'm going to show you how it's done so <coughs> so if I click over here again and see what it say it says images so this error might be due to an image which is a uh, image or images which are present on this site so if i scroll down there are lots of images screenshots of testimonials uh, screenshot of uh, websites etc so there are a lot of images over here so uh, i'll need to find out which of the images are the cause for this like for which is causing this error so what i'm going to do i'm going to take uh, with my mouse i'm going to click the uh, click the right button of my mouse right click i'm going to do a right click and then i'm going to scroll down and click on inspect element okay so i'm using a chrome browser so after doing this you see over here this area right and you go to this console see there are uh, certain there are quite a bit of errors over here so the main issue that this is gray is mainly due to the mixed content so over here you can see that uh, an image in image is still in http http and it is not converted to https so this is the main cause of this so so most probably it happened when i was making the website it was in, in it didn't had the http https protocol like the ssl certificate so uh, uh so uh, it just this image just uh, remained in https so let me like there are a lot of images in the in this page so let me see click on the image and see which image is, uh, is it so over see you can see this is the image so you can over see over here that this is the background image this is the background image which i'm using right so let me just uh, have a look at the error again go to i'm going to go to the console so mixed content so uh, this is where i'm going to focus on the mixed content issues so other issues are not uh, not really that important the mixed issues is the are the ones which like causes this error with 
like turns the HTTPS into gray and not uh, fully secure. So I'm going to what I'm going to do. I'm going to change this background image to something else. So I'm going to just just to show you. I'm going to just uh, download a random image and change this part. So let me just. So I'm going to the pixabay.com uh, free stock website for uh, stock website. So uh, there is the image. Uh, let me just use another image similar. And let me download this one. Uh, no, I'm not a robot. Okay. Okay, so let me just copy this and just uh, put it in my desktop. Just paste in, uh, paste this in my desktop over here. So, uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to. So I made this page using Elementor page filter. So I'm going to just uh, change this background and see if this uh, solves the issue. Solves the issue. Uh, let me just open the open up the Elementor editor. Uh, I don't know why it's digging. Okay, just they need. I think they have updated to a newer version. I haven't logged into this website for a long time. So, okay, good. Uh, now it's loaded. So let me just change this background image to something else. Okay, so this is the one which I have downloaded. So let me just uh, paste this over here. Upload this. Okay, so now it's changed. So let me update this page. And... Okay, so let's see fingers crossed. Let's see if it works actually. Uh, loading. Okay, see now it's turned to green with the padlock of it. See it, it worked perfectly, right? So, so this is how you solve the issue with. So I can just clear the delete the cache just to make sure. So this is the, let me just reload to it to like reload it again. So just to show you it again. Okay. So it, uh, it perfectly solved this. So, so you need to like do the same steps again. You need to click on inspect element and go to console over here and just look for mixed content issues. Just search for mixed content issues like images. You will most probably find the images. And just change the images right if you already have an SSL certificate installed so now if I click over here connection is secure so the uh, previous error is not showing uh, so if you do not have much idea about what an SSL certificate is uh, like uh, you do not know uh, you if you need to understand how important SSL certificate is uh, you can read a blog post like I've li uh, I've put a link to a blog post uh, which explain in very simple terms in layman terms uh, like uh, what an SSL certificate is like and why you should like make sure that your SSL certificate works properly. Uh, the link of that blog post is uh, down in the description below and if this uh, and if this video solved your issue then uh, please like this video also please uh, subscribe to this channel so you get more uh, more like more updates about like more videos get to see more videos like this which will make your life easier so once again thank you for watching this video